someone who has hot drink with hot meals. It's just fucking wrong. Flow like water, so I'm going mainstream. Yeah. kind of psychopath goes to McDonald's and has a Big Mac meal and a coffee. No, you, no, no. There's only one meal in the day where you should have a hot drink with it and that's breakfast. Every other hot meal, have a cold drink. You can't have hot and hot, hot and cold. That's just normal. Fucking hot drinks with hot meals. It shouldn't annoy me as much as it does, but it actually does quite a lot. I mean, if you sit down for a roast dinner, for example, you know, you've got some lovely roast chicken, you've got some roast potatoes, you've got Yorkshire puddings, the whole shebang. Oh, nice. Just pull straight into my lane. But yeah, if you're having the whole shebang, what drink do you have with it? Would you rather have, I don't know, a glass of Coke, a beer, or a cup of tea, or coffee. If you if you answer that with tea or coffee, fuck off. It's wrong. If you bite into a roast potato and go, oh fucking hell, that's too hot, my mouth's on fire. I know. I'll cool it down with this scalding cup of coffee. No. That's when you have a nice glass of coke from the fridge. If you're having hot food, which will probably burn your mouth if you're like me and you see food and you just can't not eat it straight away, you've got to have something cold to wash it down with. And if, something, if something's got stuck in your throat, you can't gulp down like six or seven big mouthfuls of coffee. I mean, if you do, you're a fucking weirdo, but you shouldn't do it. Coke, on the other hand, or water, or beer, you can down the entire fucking glass and that's socially acceptable. Downing a cup of coffee? No. Just fucking no. If one of your friends downs a cup of coffee or a cup of tea, don't be friends with them. They will probably be a serial killer. The only meals that you can have hot drinks with is breakfast or if you're having a sandwich for lunch. You've got to have hot and cold. You can't have hot and hot. And don't even get me started on people that have soup and coffee. That's two liquids. But how, how do you distinguish between what you're eating? Well, drinking. If you're having soup and coffee. It's, it's two liquids. It's two hot liquids. You have a spoonful of soup and then a mouthful of coffee. You've just had two drinks. That's not a meal. That is just really fucking thirsty hot drinks with hot meals. Can, is soup even a meal? Soup is not a meal that a healthy person has. Soup is a sick person's meal. You don't have soup if you're feeling fine. You have soup if you're feeling fucking rough. Come to think of it, is a sandwich a meal? It's just something between bread. That brings me on to another subject. What should be in a sandwich is a cucumber sandwich acceptable? I'll answer that for you. No, it fucking isn't. Cucumber in a sandwich on its own? No. If it's in there with something like uh, roast chicken, I don't know. I'm not a sandwich expert. But I do know that a sandwich has to have meat in it. You cannot have a sandwich without meat. Unless it's Marmite. Marmite sandwich 100% okay. I've just sparked up an argument between people that love and hate Marmite, haven't I? I like Marmite. You know what? I don't love Marmite. I don't hate it. They say, oh, you either love it or you hate it. I can take it or leave it. Some days I'm like, yeah, I really want a Marmite sandwich. And other days it's like, oh no, I can't, can't be bothered. So I don't want Marmite. I don't like it today. Yesterday I loved Marmite. Today, no. So people saying Mar it, something's a very Marmite subject, it just means it's a fucking subject, because you can either love it, hate it, or have no strong opinions. 
how is my driving? Cool. And then they've blocked out the number for you to call. You cannot tell them how their driving was. Sneaky. Also, how is your driving? Overly cautious, buddy. But yeah, Marmite, you don't either love it or you hate it, because I can take it or leave it. Used to love it. Used to absolutely love it. Couldn't have enough Marmite. Now, meh. I'll eat it. I don't fucking love it, though. Anyway, I have no idea why I'm ranting about this, but it's been bugging me, so now it can bug you. You're welcome. I'll catch you in the next one. I'm going mainstream. Mainstream. Flow like water, so I'm going mainstream. <laughs>